Good morning, viewers. Shira here. Uh, I have a day off of work, so I decided to take advantage and go on a trip. I probably should have started filming about three hours ago, but I've been so out of practice with vlogging. I've just been so, so, so busy. Really, I'm busy basically with work. I work full time and between shifts, I'm just too tired to put my thoughts together to make a video. Today, taking a break to go on a trip up north of Skhalanel and a couple of other people who we found on Facebook. When we left the house at 4.30 in the pitch black. And now 7 a.m. we are in Tiberia, Tiberias, at the burial site of Rabbi Ber Mayor Balanes for davening because the men on the trip are tzaddikim and want to daven with the minion even though we're on the trip. <laughs> and uh, if you want to see behind me, um, that's the Kinneret. Just so beautiful and calm and quiet at this hour of the day. So now it's uh, about an hour and a half later, still driving north, and we finally see the first view of snow. Like, look around here. Everything is green, and there in the distance are the hills of the Hermon, snow-topped hills of the Hermon. It's just unbelievable how the uh, nature changes from like one kilometer to the next. So like, we didn't see snow like this in two years. It's not so serious. It's more serious than no snow. That's, that's true. So where we are right now is... We're in the Khermon, which is the only place in Israel where you can go skiing. There's enough snow and cold enough for skiing. There's other areas in Israel that also have uh, snow, like uh, the Gush area, but they don't have mountains, so there's no snow. Welcome to Mount Hermon Ski Resort. Hi now, say hi to the people. Hello. So you might remember that the last time I did a ski vlog was at Mount St. Louis two years ago when Karanel and I were in Toronto for our engagement party. So since then we were in Toronto another time in the winter, which was last winter for Mira's wedding, and there was no snow. Uh, and I never thought that I would end up skiing again. That was my first time and I thought it was my last time. So we were very uh, spontaneous. I, uh, I'll tell you, there's an advantage of being a nurse. <laughs> By working on Shabbos, it frees up a day during the week. So today, Tuesday, I'm off, and then tomorrow I have a night shift. So we just decided to take advantage of the fact that I have a whole day off, and then tomorrow morning I don't have to wake up early and uh, to go skiing. And randomly, somebody advertised in one of the Facebook groups that he has a car and he wants to fill up the car to go up to the Fairmont for skiing. And so we said yes, and here we are. See behind me, snow, feels like winter, and uh, we're gonna go skiing now. We couldn't have chosen a better day. White snow, blue sky, sun is shining. Now we're on this ski lift, all the way up to where we're gonna go down. I don't know where we're gonna go down. I know there's a lot of paths here. Here I'm filming you. Oh my goodness, I just fell, I just am flying. Oh my god, the whole time I'm going down like, oh no, I don't want to break a limb right now. Ain't nobody got time for that. There she goes. Shira, don't fall. You can do it. Oh, you didn't fall! You didn't fall! Shira, tell, tell something to the people that are watching you. I did this this hill three times in the first time. I did not like totally do a flip when I was falling. So yay! Up there is a line for kids from schools who are waiting in line to go up the ski lift just to go up to see the view. Look how long this line is. So we're done. We've skied for like six hours. Exhausted, cold, wet. Times like these when I really wish I had a dryer. <laughs> Poor Chanel is wetter than me because he gave me his snow pants and he just went with like jeans and thermal like long johns. So very selfless. Now we're on the bus back to the parking lot eating tuna wraps that Chanel made. Yeah. 
Yeah, but I'm wet. How does this compare to Mount Sandler Way where we went in Toronto? Well, my, Mount St. Julia, yeah, I only did the, the beginner tracks, and here I did the advanced tracks, so it was much more difficult. See, so the advanced tracks are so steep that you, if you fall, you just can't get back up, you just keep sliding all the way down. So I only did the beginner medium tracks, which was enough for me, and it took me a long time until I was able to just go and straight without falling over. So it was fun, and we had a really great time, and I'm glad that you convinced me to do this. So spontaneous. Thanks again for watching! You can click here to watch my previous vlog, probably one of my best, so you might not want to miss out. Click on the squares below to either watch all my vlogs, check out my channel page, or subscribe to my channel to be the first to find out when I upload something new. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.